Thanks for joining me for MTI's Whiteboard Wednesdays. I'm Dan Adams. Today we're going to be talking about linear friction welding. Linear friction welding is a solid state joining process, much like the other friction welding technologies that we've talked about. It uses relative motion and high force in order to heat up the weld interface to the forging temperature, creating a two-piece forging. In linear friction welding, this plate would be oscillating back and forth like so, while the tube would be pushed into the plate, creating enough heat at the weld interface to forge the two parts together. With rotary friction welding, we talked about how one of the two parts that's being welded needs to be able to rotate. Linear friction welding gives you much more freedom to use complex geometries. For example, we see here a bladed disc that would be used in a jet engine application. In this case, we're taking near net shape forgings uh, and welding them to a center hub. Instead of machining this out of a solid piece, we can weld two smaller pieces together and make it much less expensive. The top drawing might represent a typical high volume automobile application. For example, part of a car frame. Solid state joining would allow you to take advantage of the, of the trend these days of trying to reduce the amount of mass that goes into the vehicle. So linear friction welding allows you to do high volume applications, near net shape applications, complex geometry applications, all with the benefit of solid state joining. Thanks for joining us for this episode of MTI's Whiteboard Wednesdays. For more information on this topic or other friction welding solutions, visit our website at mtiwelding.com.